a lock. This simple mechanism has been used to secure homes for hundreds of years. As more and more homes are becoming more advanced or smart, the lock hasn't changed much to match with the home. Our project, Keyless Entry Door, or KED, aims to improve convenience and security to the front door. KED uses FaceNet for facial recognition. The process is straightforward. At the moment, the face database folder is currently empty. I will begin with a face that isn't mine. In this case, Adrian, my partner. Once I have added Adrian's picture to the database, I run the program. The program takes some time to build the neural network. Once the program has loaded, you can see a webcam preview on the right. A green box is drawn around any detective face. This is done by the hard classifier, not FaceNet. When the hard classifier detects a face, it will then send an image of the face to FaceNet's neural network. In the program, you can see the label called FNet distance. This is the real-time value of the computed distance between the face in the webcam to the expected face from the database. The larger the distance, the more likely that the current face in the webcam is not the expected face. If the Fnet distance is less than the threshold of 0.25, then K concludes that the person in the webcam is the expected face. This threshold can be adjusted in the settings. It is clear that I am not Adrian, since the average distance ranges from 0.5 and above. After replacing Adrian's picture in the database with mine, I rerun the program. This time, the distance has drastically reduced. Fnet distance is now below 0.25. Ked unlocks the door and Facenet attaches my name around the box indicating its verification. The keygen option allows users to generate random keys. These keys can be used to open the door without using facial recognition. Users can regenerate the key if they don't like the key for whatever reason. Users can also set the key's expiration date and the time it expires. Users can also determine what type of key it is. The key can be used for courier or for home use. If the key is selected for courier, then it is sent to the courier via the network. Here's an example of using a key to open the door. Key removal allows the user to manually remove keys before their expiration date. Key history allows users to see which keys have been used to open the door and what time the key was used to open the door. CAD monitors the security of the door in several ways. Equipped with an accelerometer sensor, CAD can detect situations where forces are applied to the door. If the force is large enough, the camera will take an image at the time of incident. This image is saved for the owner to investigate suspicious activities at the door. In the situation where an intruder breaks into the house, KED detects this by noticing that the door is open but the lock remains closed. KED will then send an alarm and email the picture to the owner. Before ending the video, we'd like to give a special thank you to Dr. Brendan Morris. He was our mentor for this project and he recommended FaceNet, so his input was very crucial to this project.